In 2011, a 9 magnitude earthquake and tsunami killed around 20,000 people. In 2022, a 7.3 magnitude quake left 2 dead and 94 injured. And on the first day of 2024, 155 quakes of highest 7.5 magnitude in a day left 30 dead. Till now, a total of 143 tsunamis have killed 1,30,974 people. And this all happened in just one country, Japan. So what makes Japan a hotspot for quakes and tsunamis? Before we dive into it, do subscribe to the Money Control channel and like this video. Firstly, let's understand what is a tsunami. Tsunami is a Japanese word that literally means harbor waves. A tsunami is a series of ocean waves with extremely long wavelengths and are primarily caused by the sudden displacement of water. Unlike regular ocean waves that are generated by the wind, tsunamis can travel across entire ocean bases with devastating effects. The most common trigger for a tsunami is an undersea earthquake where tectonic plates shift and create a disturbance in the water above. As the displaced water travels outward from the epicenter, just like when you throw a stone in a pond, and this forms the initial waves of a tsunami. Submarine volcanic eruptions and underwater landslides can also displace large volumes of water, triggering a tsunami. However, not all earthquakes or volcanic eruptions lead to tsunami. The formation of a tsunami can depend on a host of factors, including the shape of the ocean floor and the earthquake's distance and direction. So next time you hear about a tsunami, remember it's like a giant underwater ripple caused by an earthquake. and be prepared to move to higher ground if you are ever near the coast when one happens now the crucial question why is japan prone to earthquakes and tsunamis the answer to this question lies in the location of japan japan is situated along the ring of fire which is the most active earthquake tectonic belt in the world the ring refers to an imaginary horseshoe shaped zone that follows the rim of the pacific ocean It has hundreds of volcanoes spanning 40,000 km and is responsible for 90% of the world's earthquakes. Within the ring of fire, there are different tectonic belts including the Pacific Plate, Eurasian Plate and Indo-Australian Plate. And in that ring of fire, Japan is located here in the Pacific Plate. Well, Earth is made up of tectonic plates that slowly move into and apart from each other. And tectonic plates keep meshing and colliding with each other, causing earthquakes, volcanic eruptions, and eventually tsunamis. But Japan has found a way to lessen the impact of the earthquakes. Japan requires buildings to be constructed with anti-earthquake designs. It also has an early warning system that stops high-speed trains, factory lines, and sends country-wide text alerts a minute before the tremor hits. So Japan's precautions might not save the disaster, but they did save countless lives.